Glacier National Park's waters officially open to boaters on the west side over the weekend, and park officials are diligently searching all incoming boats for invasive aquatic species. MTN's Nicole Miller spoke with them about how you can help reduce the possibility of spread this season. It's officially boating season here in Glacier National Park, and once again, all watercraft must be inspected prior to launching to prevent the spread of aquatic invasive species. Make sure that your boat is clean, drained, and dry. If you have an inflatable, make sure that it's all inflated so that the inspectors can take a look at it and make sure that it's all clean. With the detection of invasive mussels in the state in 2016, all watercraft must go through an inspection station before launching. Boat inspection stations in Apgar and Lake McDonald are open, but the east side of Glacier won't be open until June 1st. You just drive up, a ranger comes out, inspects your boats. You have to fill out a little form and they give you a tag if it's clean. Lake McDonald is open to motorized boats this year, but in order to launch your boat, you must have it inspected, and the park also requires a 30-day dry time. Zebra and quagga mussels, which is what we're really concerned about here in Glacier National Park, die with 30 days out of the water. So, you know, even though inspection and decontamination, those are pretty good to a degree, that 30-day dry time really helps us make sure that there are no, uh, no mussels on your boat before launch. In Glacier National Park, Nicole Miller, MTN News.